Well, Heather Graham has starred in some of the biggest films mm -hmm. of the past few decades, so yep. we thought who better to interview her than our own super roller skater, Alex. <laughs> He's the man. Yeah, good one. I caught up with Heather for a career and life-spanning chat and to hear all about her new movie. She's good fun with Dennis Quaid. Doug, what's going on? I've got an emergency up here. My wife and daughters are on this plane. <laughs> Love the film on a wing and a prayer. I got goosebumps. I, li I literally stood up and clapped my hands in that film. When we were picturing ourselves on the plane and that we could die at any moment, that yeah. was pretty stressful. Not so fun. Um, but it was fun when I watched it. It was really uh, scary and exciting. And, and then, of course, it has a feel good ending, which is amazing. Forced into a situation most can't even fathom. On a wing and a prayer tells the incredible true story of Doug White and his family who found themselves in the fight of their lives when the pilot on their plane suddenly died. I'm looking for the emergency procedures. No doubt we're going to need it. Everyone thinks movies are good if they're super dark and there's a serial killer and he kills like 20 women and it's great. And I, I think it's great to watch a movie where actually the people in it are good and they're in this really challenging situation and then some good things happen. I just was grateful to be in this positive, life-affirming story about how people help each other. Heather Graham has had a stellar career. After getting her start in the late 80s, she found international superstardom in Boogie Nights. Roller girl. Hi, hello, howdy. You know, and followed it up with roles in Scream 2, Lost in Space and Austin Powers. Shagwell by name, Shag very well by reputation. Oh, behave. And she hasn't stopped since. Most recently, the actress has been sharing the screen with Meryl Streep in Extrapolations. You've come so far. What's the secret? You look amazing. You're getting some amazing <laughs> roles. What's the secret? <laughs> Heather, come on. Oh, Tell well, me. I think you got to be, you know, do your best to be happy and enjoy life. And, and, and that comes from the inside. So, you know, my career is important, but at the end of the day, you know, it's about just you have to love yourself and just be kind to yourself. One thing you may not know about Heather is that she once dated our Heath Ledger. And in the week that would have marked his 44th birthday, the actress is reflecting on what a special person he was. Just tell me what he meant to you. Well, he's such a special person. He really brought so much, you know, joy into my life. He's a very soulful person. I mean, obviously he's very talented, but I think he's, he's, he's a magical, a magical person and I feel lucky to have known him and I just feel really sad he's not around. I mean, I wish he would have stuck around. I'm sure he would have, you know, done a lot more amazing stuff. We're going to do a, a fast five, five quick questions. Okay. And I want to get, get to know Heather Graham a little bit more. Favorite film? Harold and Maud. Tootsie as well? Tootsie, yeah, you're right. Those are my two favorite films. Favorite food? Tacos, guacamole. Celebrity crush? Okay, well, when I was a kid, I had a big crush on Sting. I, not right now, I don't have one, but, but when I was like a teenager, I, I had a huge crush on Sting. That's fair, that's very yeah. fair. Person you would least want to be stuck on a desert island with? Wait, another person I had a big crush on was Harrison Ford. Um, the person I would least want to be stuck on a desert island with. I'm thinking of some people, but I don't know if I should say them. Um, we'll end on this one. Your hero. My hero. My hero. Well, these are some pretty deep questions, huh? I like my best friend, Michael Nichols. He's just an example to me that humans can be good. He's just a sweet, sweethearted person. Make sure you buckle down back there. He's flying right toward the storms. He is never going to make this it. Guy's got no I love you, girl. You can do it. Sometimes you got to trust in things you can't see. There you go, Dennis Quaid, looking very <laughs> serious. On a wing and a prayer, it premieres on Prime Video tomorrow. Just another reminder why you shouldn't travel on small planes. Who would you <laughs> least like to be on an island with? Oh, the yeah, list is long. That's yeah. a tough question. It's a one. tough question, isn't it? You ask the hard questions, uh, don't you? Your children? <laughs> <laughs> Which ones? Mm. Which ones? No. Can you imagine yeah. anything? She's, she's great, Heather Gray. Yeah, she's beautiful. 53 years old, doing Incredible. great stuff, you yeah. know. It's not a bad film. I, I quite liked it. It was yeah. fun. Um, you know, good, good ride. Dennis Quaid, just doing what Dennis Quaid does. Yeah. He plays a type, doesn't he? Yeah. <laughs> Alex, <laughs> three stars. Hey there, Today fans. Sarah and... <laughs> What's my name again? Oh Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our YouTube <laughs> channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports, and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. That never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?